While planning this trip to Australia, so many people warned me about the wildlife here, but since arriving, I really just haven't seen that much at all. I've seen a few birds, that's pretty much it. I saw wallabies from far away, but today I'm trying to fix that and I've come to this wildlife park where there definitely should be some wildlife. It says it's about an hour and a half walk or so to the coast, which is where we've been staying all along. And I'm really hoping this is where I will see that Australian wildlife. What is that animal right there on that sign? What is that? I'm gonna find it. Emu have been spotted. So have wallabies or kangaroo? Are those kangaroo or wallabies? Mm -hmm. Hello, beautiful. Those will be some sort of kangaroo. They're like stretching out. So weird. Oh, there goes. Uh, okay, I'm right, going. Oh my gosh, she's hugging him. Do you see those two? Yeah. Shepherd. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking you guys are here. Oh yeah, there's that thing. It's kind of like a zoo at this particular wildlife park, but with less caging, there's a lot more open exhibits, and we're able to actually see the animals walk around and interact with each other, which has been really, really funny. Turkeys like jumping in and out of other birds' areas, and there's like alligators, and so many different types of wallabies. I thought there was only one type of wallaby, and it was a wallaby. Turns out there's a bunch of different types of wallabies. Still no koala sightings yet. But I didn't even know about a tree roo and we found tree kangaroos and then it kept looking at us while it was eating and it made me a little uncomfortable so we let that one have a good day by itself. Good <laughs> morning.
they've been spotted. Two koalas. Oh my god, they look kind of sad. <laughs> She's sleeping. He was just awake and then passed out. What's he holding on to? Nothing. His tail? What about this guy? So cute. Yeah, I've never seen a koala in person now I know. I want one. So slow. So sleepy. Okay, I eat now I go to sleep. You're so fat breathes. Is it true that eucalyptus leaves get you high and that koalas are just high as fuck all the time? Because this is my first time seeing koalas in person and they seem high as fuck.